Today, we're going to talk about privileged task management within Assyrian. Out of the box, we provide all sorts of tasks for Active Directory, network infrastructure, and even web-based applications. You can get instant gains by using these to delegate repetitive, mundane, and security-sensitive tasks, such as AD management, service restarts, and network changes. Assyrian makes privileged tasks easy, safe, and accountable. For this exercise, we're going to dig deep into the task of changing VLAN assignments on network switches. Although this task seems simple, it's fraught with the possibilities of human error, service loss, and privilege abuse. This is a regular and repetitive task that needs a skilled approach, especially now that telephony has converged into the IP domain. And here's the sorts of problems we're looking to avoid. Too much privilege, making sure we can't port mirror. Reconfiguring the uplink ports, that would break the network for all devices on that switch. Placing a port in a confidential VLAN. The wrong command on the wrong switch. Leaving spare ports active, a clear security risk. Our network has many switches. Today, our organisation is moving these ports from here to here. And we have VLANs for PCs, phones and printers as well as two different switch types to contend with. First, let's look at some aspects of the manual process. We need privileged access to these switches to make these changes. Here's an example of removing a port from a VLAN. See how easy it would be to mistype the port number here? If we were to misconfigure the uplink, all users on this switch would lose service. And of course, we'd have to do this in two different command sets and repeat it any number of times. Now let's see the same task running through the Assyrium desktop client. So here in our port list, there's no uplink or management port listed, and we can see clear names of the physical ports, not references to the CLI names. Done. That's made life easier, quicker, and safer. Now let's look at the next stage of this task. In the new location, the PC is connected via a phone handset, but the printer is connected as it was before, but on a different port. So, that's a lot of steps to do manually. But with Assyrium, it's easy to build these up in a template. And here's how we delegate that task to users. So here's the users that will have access to the tasks. Note here that we haven't included any tools. In this case, we don't want this group of users to have direct access to the devices. Here's the task, and here's the devices we can run it against. So let's see how this looks for the delegated user. We can even give the change request reference here. We select our port, the combined telephony and user VLAN, and, and we're done. With Assyrium, we can now take it one level higher. We can tell our task to automatically back up the config of the switch before the changes take place. Now, there's not a lot that our delegated user can do that can't be undone. With Assyrium, we've now taken a complex, multi-stage privileged task and we've made it a great candidate to delegate or outsource in a simple, secure and compliant way. Privileged task management, as a job done tick.